Assembly Member Berry's question is on women's centres in London. Thank you, Chair. Thanks for your question. In March 2018, I announced funding of £4.8 million for services to support the rehabilitation of female offenders in the community. This includes investment to maintain London's two existing women's centres in addition to funding a new centre from 2019. I have welcomed the committee's report, which is a significant examination of provision for female offenders in London. Central Government has done too little in this area since the publication of Baroness Jean Corson's report over 10 years ago. The sudden closure of HMP Holloway has removed key resources for the rehabilitation of women offenders in London, and there is yet to be any real investment uh, of any savings back into London. Female offenders are low volume, but they have high levels of vulnerability, and there is strong evidence uh, showing that investment in women's centres and specialist provision can have a significant impact on reducing reoffending. Our Police and Crime Plan includes effective diversion and community intervention as a key commitment. Since its publication, I have committed over £5 million to support the rehabilitation of female offenders in London, including £4.6 million investment in the existing uh, women's centres and a new women's centre, and a further £0.5 million has been committed for services to support police diversion. In contrast, the Government, who have a statutory responsibility to provide funding, have recently invested only £3.5 million across the whole of England and Wales, and we're well, yet to find out what share will be coming to uh, London. As part of the MOU, uh, there is a commitment to working together to develop a whole systems approach with the Justice uh, Secretary. We think this should include looking at opportunities for financial devolution to empower London to uh, deliver uh, this. The, the MOPAC and the MJ and wider partners are working towards developing a blueprint for responding to female offending in London. Of course, I'll make sure the committee is involved in that work as well. Thank you very much, Mr Mayor. Um, just a couple of follow-up questions, um, and thank you for your response to the, the report as well. Um, during our investigation, we heard about the development of a pilot project to help divert women from the criminal justice system. I think you just said half a million pounds was, was going into that. Um, the Police and Crime Plan published in March last year said this was something you were going to do, and it was planned for summer 2018. And then in your response to our report, you said it would start later this year. And then the Met's response to the report said it would start in early 2019. So can you confirm sure. and make it clear when the pilot will actually start and say why there's been such a delay? Yeah, I mean, I think it's more conspiracy, more cock up than conspiracy. The delay was with the MOU being agreed with the MHA. I'm not, I, I think the, the current Just Secretary has been very good, David Gork, in, in meeting with us getting officials to move fast. The MOU is now done. Mm -hmm. uh, the way the financial year works means we couldn't do it in, in the year we'd like to do it. We're going to go as quickly as we can. And again, we'll work with you to make sure you're updated with developments and stuff. But there's no, th there's no conspiracy or reason for the delay except mm -hmm. for the delay in the MOU and, and making sure we can spend the money in the right time as soon as we can. And do you have a date for the pilot to start then? Uh, I, I, Chair, I can, I, can, I, can, I can contact you. Uh, I'll get my office to contact you about when we think it'll we'll start. Okay, great. Um, you also talked about Holloway Prison closing. That was in November 2015. Um, and the site has been completely empty since. Um, it still hasn't been sold, but the prison minister says it will be sold at the end of 2018 now. Um, realistically, though, that's still probably years before the site is actually starting development. Um, campaigners have called for a women's centre to be included in the new plans, but given your support for meanwhile use, will you try and negotiate with the Ministry of Justice to open the visitor building that's sitting outside of the prison walls um, on the Holloway site for the community to use as a women's centre during this period while we're waiting for development to start? I think, I think what, says, what we want is the government to, to start investing now in services for women and not wait for the site to be sold off because they know it's going to be sold off and then we'll make the money back. So yeah, no, I'm talking about is, right now that building so, is so just my money is, There's no reason why the government can't reinvest Holloway Prison proceeds now. Number mm -hmm. two, the council, as part of its development brief, includes the possibility of mm -hmm. uh, women's centre being there, including affordable housing. Mm -hmm. As far as meanwhile use is concerned, it's really an issue for the council uh, to look into with anybody who wants to use the, the visit okay. centre for meanwhile use. My only concern would be is history tells us that meanwhile use can become blurry in relation to when people will leave, but also I want that to be at the expense of a permanent presence of a visitor centre or treatment or a women's centre in London. And what I'd rather do is, is lobby for investment in permanent uh, facilities in London rather than the meanwhile use being used as an excuse not to invest in the provision of services for women who need it. No, I agree. Will you, will you discuss that with the Ministry of Justice and maybe convene the Council and the Ministry to, to see what can be done just in the meantime? Well, well, Chair, what I'm happy to do is speak to the Assembly Member for the area and the Thank Council uh, about what they think. In, the so I always interest to be speak to those on the ground. I'm happy to speak to the Assembly Member and the, and the Council right. about that. Okay. Fantastic. Thank you very much. The